channel. Today I'll be talking about my skincare routine and I'll be dividing it into two parts. Uh, I think that's kind of four. Into two parts of daytime and nighttime skincare routine. So what I'm going to show you today, um, these are the parts that I'm using at daytime. So let's start with my cleanser. This is my favorite cleanser. This is the Ipsu Share Sebo Vegetal Purifying cleansing gel and I have a review of this on my blog together with the whole um, three more products from the Sebo Vegetal line. Um, I have the toner and the cream, uh, moisturizing cream both I'm using for my clients because they're one of the best products that I've been using, uh, that I've tried. That's why I better have that on my makeup artist kit. Um, and then it also comes with a serum, but I've run out of it. I've finished it up to the last drop because it's very nice. Just like this one. So yeah, I've been using this for like five months now. Um, good if you have oily skin. Um, I have really large pores and it gets really oily after a few hours that I apply makeup. On with my toner and this is what I'm using right now. The L'Oreal Revitalift Laser X3 Anti-Aging Power Water. It doesn't sting, it feels just like water on my skin and it feels like I'm just like um, cleansing my, my face with water and it has anti-aging properties and it feels so good on the skin, it feels so light, that's why I really, really love this toner. I don't like toners that sting my eyes but this one I haven't experienced that. After my toner, I go all with my L'Oreal Youth Code Boosting Essence. This kind of prep my skin. Um, for the other products I'm going to apply after and yes, you can use this twice a day, day and night and it doesn't feel greasy, it doesn't feel heavy on the skin it is just the right uh, moisture and I feel that my skin is super healthy whenever I use this um, essence so I'm super in love with it my sunblock and this is what I'm currently using the Bello Sun Expert SPF 40 Pay plus plus plus. I love this one because it also has anti-aging properties. Um, set into my 25 year of like of my life, I've been so much obsessed with anti-aging products. Um, not to the extent that everything is anti-aging, but I make sure that I use uh, most of the skincare line that I'm using. They are they have anti-aging properties or they are focus for anti-aging and this is one of the best sunblocks that I've used it gets absorbed really well by the skin you can use this every single day and it doesn't feel greasy it doesn't make my skin super duper oily um, it's just one of the best and it's also affordable for only 350 I believe in Watson's and Mercury drug stores and when I am going to the gym this is what I'm using I left the, the tube in my gym bag because it's really for my gym um, it's the Shiseido Wet Force it has SPF um, 50 plus and pay plus 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 it's very water resistant and it kind of boosts the power of protection when it gets in um, um, in contact with water and sweat that's why I really love this one it also has um, anti-aging properties and it's just expensive around 2000 but it's really worth it after my sunblock I go on with my moisturizer and this is what I'm currently using the Avon Hydrans Optimal. Um, it's a light hydrating cream. It also has SPF 20. Whenever I feel lazy to put on sunblock, this is what I'm I'm using because it also it already has SPF 20. Or whenever I just stay indoors, I use just use this one. Um, I always tell on my blog uh, that you should use sunblock or moisturizer moisturizer that has SPF. Um, at least 15 to 30 every single day even if you're staying indoors because UV and UVB rays they pass through um, the windows and uh, it's it's really helpful if you use products that has SPF especially at daytime even if, even if you're not going out they will help your skin um, to avoid um, skin damage sun damage and things like that so Highly recommend using moisturizer with SPF. And then after my moisturizer, I go on with my eye cream. And what I'm using right now is the Revitalift Laser X3. It also has anti-aging properties. And what I really like about this is the tip. As you can see, it has um, like a metal tip that it's very easy for me to kind of massage my under eye area. And it feels so cold. And yeah, it's kind of additional pampering 
experience whenever I use this eye cream. Um, one of my most favorite products, this is the L'Oreal Revitalift Magic Puller. This works as a primer and as a moisturizer and also I believe it also has um, SPF. Also anti-aging and this has long-term benefits if you use this continuously um, because the main function of this product is to blur out your pores, your wrinkles, and blemishes. And if you use this continuously, um, it will really help um, reducing the appearance of those things like permanently. But it will take time, you know, it won't be like after a week or a month. It will take time, but at least it is long term. It has long term benefits and smells so good too. This is what I, I've been using like as a primer as well. So yes, I have a review of this on my blog. You can also check it out. And then after all of those things, don't forget to put on lip balm. And this is what I'm using right now, the Sebamed Lip Defense for Dry and Chapped Lips. It has SPF 30, so I highly recommend this to all of you guys, especially now it's summer and it's very, very hot outside and the sun damage is like crazy, so better use this one. Um, I've also talked to the sales lady in PCX and she told me that it is the favorite lip balm of smokers because, um, let's admit it, when we smoke, I don't smoke, but when people smoke, your, their lips get darker and this kind of help rejuvenate the lips and moisturizes the lips and all of those good stuff. Plus it has SPF 30 and it has vitamin E, has jojoba oil. That's about it for my skincare routine, my skincare products. At daytime, I'll be showing you guys my nighttime skincare routine. Yeah, that's how I take care of my skin. It, it, um, what you call this? I can't find words right now. Uh, what you call that? <laughs> I don't know. Anyway, um, yes, um, taking care of your skin, it is very very important especially for me um even if you like applying makeup when you have really nice canvas which is your skin you will find it very easy for you to apply makeup and your makeup adheres to your skin even better i will end this video now and if you have any other questions i'll be um posting everything all of the information in the description box like if i have a review of anything here i'll be putting that down below and if you have any other suggestions or comments you can just put it down in the description um, just in the comment section you can also contact me on facebook twitter instagram and google plus on my fb page and yes um that's it i will see you next time don't forget to Hit like and subscribe if you find this video helpful. If you have any other suggestions, just let me know. And yes, bye and I will see you next time.